got uh, Lon Phillips Sullivan on the line to break down the LSU draft for us here in 2021. You can catch Lon's work, of course, at LSU Odyssey. You see right there on the banner with all that receiving talent. Racy McMath didn't necessarily get a whole lot of play, but it's still good enough despite just 33 catches for his entire LSU career with four touchdowns. Good enough to get drafted in the sixth round by Tennessee. It's because of that speed. It's because of that height. The, the package of speed and height and just aerial assassin catching ability, Mark. It's a steal for, for someone like Ryan Tannehill. So deep in the draft, a weapon, uh, a really good weapon when you got a, that kind of a running back with Henry back there. You need to have a guy who can take the top off of the, of the defense. Racy McMath is that guy. Uh, he's an absolute brilliant receiver, but here's the thing. He had some injuries. He had, he had some development issues. And then he seemed to kind of only be more of a solid contributor type of guy with the four touchdowns, as you saw. And there was a lot of missed opportunities I saw from Racy that left me wondering. And year in, year out, it was always, will this year be the year that Racy McMath explodes? And so many said, you know, I'm going to be the guy to predict that Racy McMath is going to explode. I'm going to be the big Racy supporter, I'm going to say, and then always they would be the first people to hide if if Racy didn't uh, go up to their expectations. I feel like with with a quarterback like uh, Ryan Tannehill, I think Racy, you know, the sky's the limit. This guy's a worker, uh, and that co- that combination of speed and height in the NFL, it's going to kill opponents. So I'm excited to see what he'll do. I'm I'm really, it's kind of a toss up to me. But I, I'm pulling for Racy in every way, shape, or form, and I think I think he can do it. And you also see that uh, combination of size and speed on special teams. He can really come down and cover those kicks and lay into somebody. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm so glad you said that, Mark, because he just absolutely knocked the crap out of some people. <laughs> I mean, some of his hits, Mark, vicious. I love that. 